Once again, the Easter eggs, and allusions to Game of Thrones in Episode 3 of House of the Dragon Season 1 do a good job of bridging the gap between the prequel, and its parent program. House of the Dragon, like Game of Thrones before it, spends a lot of time in the first few episodes positioning different characters and plot points across the chessboard that is Westeros. Nevertheless, House of the Dragon's chronology advances by two years, revealing the climactic days of Demon Targaryen, and Corlys Valerian's battle for the Stepstones in a manner that wasn't there so early in Season 1 of Game of Thrones. The conflict serves as a bookend to the episode and offers most of the program's excitement, giving Demon a chance to demonstrate his prowess as a warrior, allowing for some authentic, gritty ground combat and lots of dragon action. There's some old-fashioned politics in the middle, despite the fact that King Viserys may simply want to have a few drinks and a laugh. It's a timely reminder that power struggles never end and that people would go to any length to achieve their goals, such as Otto Hightower's proposal to marry Rena Targaryen off to her two-year-old half-brother Aegon. House of the Dragon proves once again that it is capable of delivering much of the drama and action that fans of Game of Thrones adored, while avoiding the trap of seeming like a mere retread. The similarities and connections are made clear through the text's allusions and little nuances. See all the references to Game of Thrones and other hidden gems in the third episode of House of the Dragon's first season. Another allusion to Nymeria is found in the song Rhaenyra Adores. Rhaenyra is adamant that the song be played, and the words include, she escaped with her ship and her people. Beneath the dragon's sight. Nymeria, the princess who led the Rhoyna to safety in dawn following a conflict with the Valyrians, the ship alluding to the 10,000 ships that are said to have sailed, the dragon's eye referring to Valyria seems to be the inspiration for this saying. It's interesting to note that this isn't the first time Nymeria has been referenced as an Easter egg in House of the Dragon, Rhaenyra and Alicent learned about her in the very first episode. House of the Dragon continues to lay the groundwork for the Game of Thrones spin-off, 10,000 Ships, which will focus on Nymeria and her adventure, 